Hello everyone and welcome to the next part of Ace of Boshi's Tale. Today we're taking on Paskuma Temple of 50 floors and then the next and then the dungeon. I hope you're all ready. So now we begin where we left off. Alright, now then, since we're taking on Paskuma Temple, let's get a team together. Change. You've had enough fun for now, I'll see. Let's get Nazmi back in. Hashidori, switch you for Rukia. There we go. Just make sure who's got what. All right. I'll put catch up some. Sit with her. All right. We got our team. We're going to. Paskuma Temple. Alright. Now, well, in case those who forgot, this heals... This, uh, water heals up the, uh... Party, so get all your HP and MP back. Now then, for the added floors of Paskuma. Now we go down the floors since we got the shortcut. However, since it's not a super shortcut back to the top, it'll take a couple minutes to get from the bottom floor, which is currently 50, to get back to the uh, top. Now, the floors. Now, there are more monsters in these, but they aren't all that powerful. Foo's health hel fury alone pretty much kills them all. So right now we're just getting a uh, free target practice in and free experience. So yeah, the experience might be small, but it adds up. Now, if you're taking on the temple. Uh, if you're in the high 40s, then the floors will be pretty easy to conquer since the monsters only get a little bit stronger every 10 floors. So you really don't have to worry about them until you get to about the 40th floor. If you take it on earlier, then uh, yeah, that's understandable. But they really become a challenge on the 40th floor, not. Alright. Though I am kind of surprised that the monsters are hitting so fast. I think they might be a little mad with how fast I'm killing them. Also, the reason I'm not showing the, uh, the, uh, chats, the, the, uh, chat box for the stream is because it's, my computer's being weird and not showing it. So, yeah. Bloop. Out of the way. Oops. 
I goofed that up some. Wow. I think I might have gotten myself stuck. That's first. Yeah. That's, uh... That's a little unpleasant. Guess I was going through it so fast I didn't consider this problem. Ugh. That sucks. Gotta redo that. Well, time to get the team back together again. Thankfully, it wasn't all that far. Just a few minutes, so... Right. Equipment. I done gone goofed. I guess it's because I was in a hurry to get past these floors. And my other files, I've gotten through this pretty quickly. It's just that, uh, it's showing the stream kind of want to rush it some. I mean, yeah, you could take your time and get through it all, but when you're at a high level and done it several times already, kind of just want to rush through it. Ah! What is with this encounter rate? I think you said someone needs to take a look at that. Either that or I've just got the bad luck right now. Pop it up too fast! Who is just eating these monsters? They don't even stand a chance. Neither does my record of trying to take 10 steps without getting attacked. Oh, that's first. Let's get this done right. Right. I keep on hitting... I'm hitting the wrong buttons now. I'm sorry, it's just I kept on hitting a W instead of Q to uh, throw the items because we've gone through a lot of water dungeons that it's kind of become a reflex. Oh my god! Now 
I don't want to have to. I don't have to worry about healing right now because barely took any damage. Food's just eating the monsters, giving up for us to get the experience. So it's all good. It's good. It's good. Go away, weak monsters! Alright. One of the reasons why I gave Nesumi the Kodama's tier is because I kind of want to reach level 50 fast, because at level 50, she learns her best skill, Absolute Zero. It is an amazingly powerful ice technique. It's all the enemies. Ah! Let's go fast so we didn't have all these monsters popping up every 10 steps. There we go, that's better. I mean, yeah, I could run, but I kind of want the experience. Small experience adds up. There we go. Now let's get down to the 20th floor. Alright. Every 10 floors, you get items. 20th, 30th, 40th, and so on. Four thousand yet. Nice. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not hitting level 99 on this current build because that's just overkill. It destroys the challenge of the game. I love you, Safi Soul. Now, we got. Two red essences, an orange essence, and a pink essence. Ah, oh. You know what? Let's give a red es essence to someone. Oh, how about... Let's give it to Rukia. She does do a lot of physical damage. Pink essence. Let's give it to Fu. Make it faster. The last red and the orange essence, let's save them for now. Now you have to hit these lovers every time, because the only way to unlock the other floors. Now, let's go. Now that's just ugly. Now up to the thousands for experience.
That's still ugly. Nah, nah, that that's fugly. Huh. One survived. How dare you attack Nezumi? Kill it dead! Oh, wow. <laughs> But yeah, for the end of the current build, the highest level you want to be at is about between 50 and uh, 60, 65. Because when I finished the current build, I was around level 64. So, yeah, you want to be between levels of 50 and 65 when you finish this current build. Any higher than it's just overkill. I mean, yeah, you could go at least up to 70, but... Yeah... That might be a little too much. You want at least have some challenge. I really wish I could uh, show the uh, chat in the stream right now, but since my computer's being a little funky, I can't. And trust me, I'm going. Trust me, right now, I'm trying to get through these floors as fast as I can. Just with all these weak monsters and you have a few steps, it's just, ugh. You could take the chance to run away, but then it just gets kind of redundant. Because then there's a chance of not being able to run. It's like, yeah. Well, that could happen. As me, work your magic. Uh, just small healing. There we go. Ooh, item, item. A Sable Fuda. Wow. Oops. Huh. Whoa. I think the girls have gone a little crazy with those criticals there. <laughs> Foo keeps missing. She flies! Ugh. Whoops. I goofed. Let's let's try that again. Here's some bullshit level forty seven. All right. Finally got to floor 25.
There we go. Now we're killing these monsters faster. God damn it, fly! Stop dodging! Well, since we got him first, we get attacked twice. Whoa, foo. That's a. Uh, I think you should calm down. Oh, come on. I think we need to calm foo down. She's kind of going crazy with those crits. Oh, it's level 45 that knows me learns absolute zero. That works. Oh, now that she's got that, take that off. Just switch these around. And there we go. Right, level 45, absolute zero. I love this spell. Time to show it. Go. Whoa. That was fast. <laughs> I think they do need to calm down a little. Right. This one breaks off in four paths. So we're gonna grab the items and then continue on to the next floor. Go away, monsters! Dude, look at all these mushrooms. You can just feel what you can just feel the effects from them. There we go. Now, which one was it? Um, right, it was this one. This gets the last item, and then... Oh no. This goes to the stairs. So I just, I want to grab that last item. Whoops. <laughs> My bad. I had it backwards! Well, I kind of am backwards, so... <laughs> ah. Alright, let's grab that last item and then go down to the 29th floor. Okay, now that poison was just me. Whoa. Really? Alright. Let's heal up a little. Oh, right. Almost forgot about Eastern Hope Sheet. There we go.
Yep, these monsters are boring, you know. No more fighting them. For now. Okay. We're gonna take a bite out of these mushrooms. If I turn pink, then we know they're not edible. Ooh, I wonder what it'd be like to be pink. <laughs> All right, four thirty. Five thousand yen. Blue essence. Six Diamo souls. White essence. Hero serum. Ten Sable Fuda. Red essence. Ambrosia. And three angel walkers. Okay, so time to boost some uh, HP. Uh, I don't know who though. Uh, Rukia is kind of a tank right now. Get the SP to Nazmi. And let's have Fubi able to do more damage. Okay. We're good. Four thirty one. Well the enemies are a little tougher. And uglier. And still only takes two attacks to kill him. Wonderful. Whoa. Missed. Pretty much to conquer the current floors of Pascuma, you really just need two heavy hitters with physical attack. Well, just till you get done the 40th floor. That's when you're gonna need more power. Gotta love it. <laughs> Rookie level forty six. All right, once she gets to level forty seven, I'll take the Kodamas to your offer. I don't want them getting too high leveled. Good. Nezumi level 46. And I get surprise attacked with laser beams. Heal up and slashy slashy. Uh, right. Food level forty nine. She's really strong there. Oh, 
I think Fu might be on a rampage. Wait, then what's over here? Right, items. Stop dodging! Safi Soul, Life Ampule, and a Sable Fuda. How many Sable Fudas do I have now? I'm getting so many, it's ridiculous. Oh my. 53. I think I got enough to last for a good while. I can pretty much save anywhere at any time, whenever I want to. But you do want to do as much training as you can here in Pascua, because once you get down to the 49th floor, you will be in for, for a, uh, oh, how should I put this, a temple boss fight. Yeah. Trust me, it is ugly. Right before the stabs, what the heck? Rookie has level 47. The Kodama tier comes off. And she gets the momentum bell again. Alright. Treasure chest. Blue Jay Helm. Yeah, there are items on this floor that you have to get. I mean, you, you can get them if you want to. It'd be a good idea to get them while going down the floors, because... I don't think you want to go through uh, so many counters just to get the, a lot of these items. The blended, blended breastplate. Huh. <sighs> Oops. Okay, once Nezumi gets still level 47, then I'll just ignore the enemies for now. I mean, yeah, I'll at least want to kill a set for a, uh, for the podium, but, uh, yeah. Alright, Nazmi's level 47 and she learned Medea Rahan. Now the weighted getter comes off and the Minish boots go on. There. Now we do not need the uh, weighted getter or the uh, Kodama's tier for a while. And I mean for a while. I do not want to break the game by getting any more higher level. Plus, I think a uh, liquid here is gonna kill me. Since I'm already near level, basically level 50 with Foo. 
right. Yeah, that kind of hurts the power. Yeah, it looks like the arms you do get won't be much help at this kind of step. Ooh, wait! Dance fight a cap. That that would definitely help with Rukia. Let's make him more vicious and powerful. Ah, <laughs> oh, one step. All right, we got all the items for this floor. Let's head on down to the next floor after you get that item. And I can't run. Okay, that detonate was not necessary. There we go. Bye bye. I didn't think about it. What's each one? Oh, she. Okay, 13, 10, 23, 15. Well, now. Floor 37. What do we get in here? The Goblin Bandana. Yeah, now I'm just gonna run from all these monsters on the last few floors, because, well... I'm kind of just annihilating them. Yeah, that's not gonna help. I just wanna get the items, because, well... I want to. Ooh, the Cerulean Bracelets. Uh, magic attack drops like four, but it will be helpful. I've got to have the copper bangle for her. Yeah, that's that's better. All right. The holy headband. No! A boost. That does give a good boost. So, let's do that. I got hit by a laser beam. And not good. I confuse. Oh, wait. It didn't confuse her. Let's overkill him! Strike him down! Wow! <laughs> Did not expect that much damage! Oh. Oh. The imps. Oh man. That doesn't help that much. But dear Rama. Woo! Yay! Nine viewers! I feel special! Alright, grab this last item, then we'll head up to the next floor. Cerulean bracelets. Again. Get away, monsters! They're too weak. All right. Just two more floors. Then the real challenge begins. I'm just kind of going nom 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 with these monsters. Topaz headband. Oh, let's see now. Ooh, the monk's habit. 
Mark. What is that right now? Oh. Right, he can't wear it. <laughs> but she can. It's not really that helpful right now. Let's see now. Do I want to... Do I want to... Do I want to be mean and get food to level 50? Make a strong imp? Yes. Yes, I do. Let's balance out to level 50. Because I can. Just because I want to make Liquid mad at me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it is a good idea to save right now, because I get the feeling that I might crash. I mean, the game might crash on me again like it's done before. And I'd be so mad at this point. Sorry, 42 minutes in, I'm not going through all that again. No. That's where I just go ballistical. Come here, item. Oh. Save a Fuda. Whee! Floor 39. Oh, right, I was gonna kill those things. Oops. The Holy Hakama. Now this I know he can wear. Look at that status boost! It is just beautiful! Bye bye, Shadow Hakama! Hello, Holy Hakama! Right now, Isen Boshi is holy! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, that was bad. That was bad. But I couldn't resist. An ether detonate, huh? Kill him, foo! The Midnight Crown. Yes. Just yes. I'm liking these boosts already. Be even better if these monsters would go away. But then again, I do want to kill them to get food to level 50. Just to make Liquid mad at me. <laughs> wow, two steps. <laughs> Which I think might be working. You know what? Let's let Nesmi have some fun. Absolute zero. Yes. Love that spell. Whoops, wrong way. Counter attack and no confusion. Thank you for the free power boost. Alright, boost level 50 now. Ah. Gotta give love to the imp girls. Scarlet Robe. Nope, doesn't help.
Mein Ups. Ace and Boshi level 49. Wait, wasn't I supposed to go down one of these paths or was I coming up it? Okay. Wait, I went the wrong way. I went backwards! Oh my god! No! Rukia, level 48. Alright, let's go up the right steps. Uh, yeah. And I can't run. There we go. The 40th floor. Now the challenge gets real. Now let's grab the items from here. The Aiju no Daba. This is Eastern Boshi's weapon. Oh right. Since I got the stuff from the uh, village of sprites. <laughs> They're kinda not all that powerful right now. Yeah, I'll just grab him and go. Whee! Alright. One floor 41, which means eight more floors and we face the current temple boss. If I can remember which way to go. I'm a little lost. This always gets me lost. Bye bye. Oh right, I did want to kill them. Derp. Which way was I supposed to go again? Oh, there they are. Found the steps. Now that is just ugly! Target practice! Yeah! <laughs> that was fun. Now. If you want to get all the items on this floor, you can, but the monsters are a lot stronger. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip grabbing some of the items and just go right for the stairs. Because, well, I kind of wanted to get to that boss fast, plus we still have another dungeon to do before we face the next greatest challenge. The Shishoka's Lair. And that's gonna be one doozy of a dungeon. I like 443. It's simple, like me. Pumpkin! Let's kill it! and make pumpkin pie out of it. Pie. Whoops. Huh. I reflexed. How? That was just mean. But foo's meaner. <laughs> Alright, let's uh... Take care of this small problem. Now 
There we go. All better. Got it. No reflection this time. Spin and slash. Yay! Whoops. I walked into the wall. That happens a lot. Alright, these monsters are boring me now. Five more floors! This is gonna be awesome! Because everything is awesome! Eh, let's grab that item. Run away! Whoops. Uh oh. Can't run. Gotta fight. Yeah, the thing is, if you fail to run once, you have to fight. Because it will get a little ugly if you don't. If you try to keep on running and it keeps failing. Oh. That did not just happen. Now I'm a little mad. You don't paralyze one of my best characters. Foo, strike him down. I win. All right. I walk into a wall and get attacked by monsters. That's, uh, interesting. Ugh. Yay! Steps. Alright. Just a few more floors. Oh, come on! That was just uncalled for! <sighs> oh, wait. Yeah, I have to. I have to. Power of a level 2 limit break. And that was just uncalled for. <sighs> but yeah, fighting them, you do get over 3,000 experience. So, it's pretty good to fight them. Just don't overdo it. I'm not going to trap myself again. If I do, then I'm going to kick myself.
bubbles! Well, I can't run, I gotta fight. Yeah, it looks like the chance of me escaping without fights is going down less. Alright. Just a few more floors. I should save. My senses are tingling. Should I kill them? Yeah, I'm gonna annihilate them. Just cause I can for that 3000 experience. There we go. Level 50 Eastern Boshi. Food level 51. Double level up. Gotta love it. Yeah! And can't escape. That's not good. Rookie, level 49. I'm getting an evil look from from Liquid. I'm getting too over leveled. That's what he's thinking. Uh, right. Ooh, the lesser Oni. I haven't fought you yet. All right. Mall flash freeze. Token and vandalize. That was awesome. And I can't run. That's not good. Which means I gotta fight. Why you- Whoa! Boo! I guess I should try to calm her down. Alright. Both ster stairs leave the same place. There aren't any treasure chests here, so... It's safe to make it to the stairs. Or not. <coughs> mm. 
Now I gotta annihilate these guys. Fu, Nezumi, take him down. Whoa. Uh huh. Fu, <laughs> calm down. Fu, Nezumi level 49. Nice. Out of the way! I'm coming through! Alright. Floor 49. This is where the boss is at. Definitely grab that. Escape. Alright. Now. We heal up before facing the boss and save. Let's see now. Do that. Save. And now, it's time for Paskuma Temple's Floor 49 Boss. Prepare for battle. Let's go! That, there it is. The ugliest boss you'll see so far. <laughs> Alright. Oh, that's not good. That is uncalled for! <sighs> Let's see now. Here we go. Angel water. Now... Hell's Fury... You know what? Let's make it one a bit tougher. Ha! Counter attack, baby. All right, foo. Show him your rage. Nezim and Rukia vandalize it. All right. Actually, it should heal up. Now, the reason why I'm able to that. Rukia is dodging and counterattacking so much is due to her level 2 limit break Wild Star. It boosts her attack, magic attack, and agility greatly and increases the chances of counterattacking by a great amount. Which is why she's doing over 3k damage and killed the spider. 20,390 experience gained, 4055 yen earned. 
Yusuf Boshi, level 51. Fu, 52. Rukia, 50. The 50th floor. Now we get some amazing items. Ha! <sighs> Three legendary elixirs. Two Ambrosia. Sixteen hundred yen. A counter pendant. Six white essence. Now this rainbow essence you have to keep. All right. The rainbow essence boosts all status. Save this for right now. Now the white essence. Like Rukia will over tank. Get Nesmi's HP up some. And get some Eastern Boshi. Alright. Now then. Here's a little uh, detail. With this current build right now, anything past 450 is basically unfinished. So if you try to go to floor 51, it'll take you back to floor 41. Like so. Now then. <clears throat> Everyone, take a break, grab a drink. This is going to take about uh, five minutes to get back up top. So, come back in a few minutes. Because i got to go through 40 floors manually. Before we can continue to the next dungeon. <sighs> this is a bit annoying. I mean, yeah, it's a shortcut, but still, you're climbing up so many floors. Go away, weak monsters. You bore me. Ugh. All right. We've we've made it just about back to the top. We're on floor 21, about to hit floor 20. That's another 10 more floors to go up. And then another 10. Curse you, liquid tension! You couldn't have made an instant warp point from 50 to the top? Ugh! Right at, the, right at the bottom of the steps! Alright. We're finally back to the last ten floors. Thank God! Thankfully, that only took an hour and ten minutes to do. All right. We 
finally made it back. All right. Now then. This one is going to be a little different. We're going to be changing the teams. However, the audience in the chat gets to pick the team. So who will be going with Ethan Boshi and Fu? Let's see, who will it be? For we have Elsie, Hachidori, Kamu, and Quadier. We got Elsie the Pixie, Hachidori the Kobatengu, a Scout, and a Dijin. <laughs> now then, let's see who is it going to be. So, well, choice I've made. We're going with Quadir and Hachidori. Hmm, this will be a bit of a challenge. I like it. Now. We gave Hachidori some major equipment boosts. We give him the Kudamas tier. Quadir. Yeah, he's good. That's good. There we go, the monk's hut. He's already slow enough as it is, so the way to get a well help boost his uh, level some. Whoops. But yeah, the counter pendant, you want to give that to either Fu or Rukia, because, well, it boosts the counter attack rate. Actually, let's give that to Fu right now. There we go. Alright. We'll save. Now we are off to Fu's dungeon. One of my favorite dungeons so far. You'll see why. Don't, don't have to worry about these monsters, they're only up to level uh, 5. <laughs> Alright. Now the location of this dungeon is really close actually. Not there. Right here. We go in the hole in the tree.
Fu's Dungeon. Now we get to hop over lily pads and fight. Bird! Ah, there it is. That's not good. Double counter attack. Love it. Ouch! That only took out food. Ha! Bye bye, birdie! Hot to a level 35. Alright. What's now? Let's get Hot to HP up song. Now let's give Quadia some more defense. And... Yeah, it's good. Oh, right. I don't... Ooh. This is gonna be fun. Wait, no. Hell's Fury. Got one. Right, over here. And down here. Whoops, I forgot about the silence. Go foo! Go away, monsters. Stop beating up my team. Alright. Let's fr let's fry this fishy. Fishy fishy. Fishy fishy. I overcooked the fish. I burned the fish. I didn't mean to. Uh right. I wanna go this way. Nice. 
Billy took out Hachi Dori. Twenty-eight, five fifty-two. Come on, you guys are so close to leveling up. Whoops, I went the wrong way. This is definitely a lot harder when you have a mix and match team. But that makes it more fun. Only residents. Nice. Alright, let's get rid of that silence. Out of the way, waterfall. Yeah, I would be skipping these guys, but uh, Hashiro and Quadia need the uh, experience. Hachidori the most, because he's only at level 36. Delicious, well, uh, Cardia, whatever. It's a name I goof up on. Leave me alone! Up we go! Let's use this level two. Cause it's fun. The foo counterattack. Ooh. Love doing that. You gotta admit though, the themes the theme music for this is just amazing. It's so catchy. And it fits ooh, perfectly. Bye, bug. Bye, mutant seahorse. Hey, no paralyzing. Hush, joy level thirty seven. Wow, I think. Oh my god, no! Ah, it's 
powered up. Not fast, but powered up. There we go. Uh... Right. I am going the right way. I just got a little confused for a second. Yay, I ran away! Hoppity hop 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 hop. All right. Now then. For those who have been waiting, we are nearing dun -dun -dun -dun, the giant scene. Yes, I said that. Because it's true. We're coming up to it. Ow! Got stung. Ooh, level 53. Whoops. Ooh. Didn't see that there. Whoa. Let's just take care of these guys real fast. That was awesome, Hachi Doty! You escaped death! Alright, just quick healing up. Because it is needed. Alright. Slap on Sevo Fuda. Now then, for the moment everyone's been waiting for. Well, reach the tunnel of... Well, basically a lot of tunnels on water, but, uh... I don't know what we're gonna do here. Well, Fu can, uh, go underwater and hold her breath for a while, but that's just Fu. Pretty much can't do anything. Uh, what?
she used Ibuki's ballot to make the, part, the rest of the party smaller. I have a very ominous feeling about this now. This is very risky. So thankfully we don't encounter any enemies here. So now Fu's just trudging along and holding a breath underwater with the rest of the party in her mouth. That uh that pretty much defies logic there. Works for me! I defy logic too. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. And it's a short trip, so yeah. right back in just one moment.
And I am back. Sorry about that, folks. But, uh, now we continue. Let's just take a look at Hot Joy for a second. 1800. Not bad. Alright. 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 Let's continue. And before we can even leave, we get attacked. That's where you give food the counterattack pendant. More damage. There we go. Now we hop across the lily pads once more. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, thankfully with Using Boshi's passive ability, where well, well, one of his uh, teammates gets uh, really weakened, like they're about to die, he uses himself as a meat shield to protect them. Good guy, Eason Boshi. Ow! That stun hurt! That was awesome. A double counter attack. There we go. Double death. Rock over this rock. Yeah, I know I'm doing a lot of fighting, but because well, we got to get Hashidori up some levels. He's only at 38. Can't have that. Thankfully, with the Kodama's tier, you get. Get the uh, experience double. Yes, level thirty nine. Healing spots. Heal up. And save. And continue. I just gotta remember which way to go. Trust me, not trying to take so long. There's, just, there's a lot of places to go through and a lot of monsters to fight. And they both dodge! Ah, 
Nice. The higher level up, the faster he gets, the faster he becomes. Kill it! Kill it dead! There we go. Nope, not this way. Got moon dew. Not this way either. This does become a little confusing after a while. this way. I'm not sure. Well, only one way to find out. Stabby, stab, stab. I was uncalled for. Just as I was about to kill it, too. No, not this way either. Which way was I supposed to go again? Right, it was this way. No. Blarg! Oh wait, I remember now. Nope. Hold on. I know I'm going backwards. Alright. This way. This way. Nope. Arrgh! Ah, oh, crud. Who's paralyzed? Time to run. Oh, right, I forgot about that. <laughs> Oops. Leave me alone, I'm simple, okay? I just got lost a little. A lot. Okay, I was completely backwards. Go foo! Hashidori level 40, now we're getting somewhere. Not bad, five levels in one dungeon. For Hashidori, that is.
Alright. We just lost Hachidori. Uh, Right. He doesn't need the way to get it anymore. Or we can't give him the silk boots to make him faster. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, let's roast this bird. Yeah, birdie, birdie, birdie. Time to get roasted. So close. Almost made it without taking any damage. Oh well. There we go. Onward! I think we're coming up to the boss now. Yep. We are. Alright. Let's heal up. Save. Let's go. Whoops. Ha! I was off by a couple maps. <laughs> I was thinking of another dungeon. Can't run, gotta fight. The. Well, that's not good. <laughs> Did not expect them to annihilate him like that. They're getting really up there in the levels. Great. Over here. Okay, now we're about to reach the boss. Finally. They got the maps backwards, right? Don't... Don't pick on me. Whoa! Whoa! He's some Boshi Fu! Calm down! That was overkill! Oh. 
hole in the floor. I think we found a spot. Yep. Alright. Time to save. Again. Sudden silence. That is never good. Now we fight Dark Foo. Crud. This is not good. Right. Full power. Out of 
Apocalypse is powerful. Win, but we get no experience because, well, we basically took on our own teammate. Now for the boss fight, Tainted Soul. Now, Fufu's level 2 limit break! Let's see what it is. And she fires lasers! That's amazing! The Fu laser! Okay, okay, before I continue, before I continue this fight, there is a, uh, really 
funny, but a easy way to win this fight without having to go more than a, a few turns. And all it takes is just one technique. That's all it does. And I know that Liquid's gonna change it soon, because I'm about to expose this little secret. But, uh. <clears throat> Cast Dark Illusion. All magic will be reflected for three turns. I mean, yeah, you can still power up if you want to, but... It's pretty much going to annihilate itself at this rate. <laughs> I'm sorry, Liquid. It won't... I was just bound to find out about it sooner or later. By using Dark Illusion, the fight becomes so much easier that it's kind of a... <laughs> yeah. Even if you don't win in the three turns, just keep casting Dark Illusion once and then it's just pretty much a hands down instant win game. No damage taken, no stat problems, it's just. Yeah. It becomes a total one sided fight. There we go. 17,900 experience earned. Almost 20,000 yen found. Hashidori gains two levels thanks to it. I think I might be in a little trouble with the uh, liquid tension now that I've shown that secret. I mean, everyone else is going to learn about it sooner or later, so... Yeah... At least I didn't expose some of the other secrets, but... Those I'm keeping to myself. Because it's fun. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to get annihilated now. <laughs> Alright, now that that fight's over, and all this dialogue is just about done... And Fu is lucky... Now then, let's get the Steel Breaker back to full power!
Now, we prepare to for the assault on Shishoka's lair. And now, we fast travel back to the entrance. Which means, go right from the boss to the entrance. Alright. <laughs> now then. We head back. See a little more dialogue. And for the special part of the game too. Now, so far come on, two steps. Now, so far, we've gained affection points for a certain someone in the party. These affection points will lead to a special scene. With four girls, meaning four different routes. Now, Time to get through some of the uh, main dialogue, then see the special event for the girl who got the most affection points. Alright, now, before we return, we have to save. Oh, man. Oh, 61. Alright. Take that off. Alright, we made it back. Now for the awesome dialogue. Now that we have the seal break at full power, we can break the barrier blocking Shishoka's entrance. This is one of the top events of the game. However, Yeah, everyone's pretty much scared at this point because Shishoka is pretty much a demonic goddess that wants to destroy everything, reduce, basically annihilate it all to nothingness. 
I'm pretty sure not everyone has the courage for that. Epic music time!
And now we switch to Selene. One of the sprite folk we helped earlier in the game. And it's a favorite Kappa! Now to Ray, the Shrine Maiden! You can just feel the awesomeness from this music, and all the dialogue, too. And now... We switch... ...to the, to the night. With the girl who has the most affection points, Rukia. Now, let's see how this turns out.
And now that the moment with Eastern Boshi and Rukia is done, we go to Kamu, who's in conflict.
And now that Kamu's conflict is over, it's time to continue a little more. Pick a team to go with you, of who you want to choose. So just go with the current team that's on here, the default team. And now, we head off to Shishoka's Lair. Now you can stock up at the uh, Sprite Village if you want to on supplies, but... I'm pretty good on that for right now. Now we will shall head to the entrance of Shishoka's lair. we go. Alright. We've made it to the entrance to Shishoka's lair before the barrier. However, this is where the stream will end. For the next, for the next part, we shall take on Sh Shishoka's dungeon and Shishoka itself. is going to be a real long one for this dungeon is big very big so the stream will end here thank you all for coming and next time we take on Shishoka's dungeon and Shishoka itself till then see y'all next time and hope you had fun laters